Hey everybody, Kevin Newsom coming to you from Houston, Texas. Hoping you are doing well on this late October day. Great news from Austin this week. The Board of Regents confirming the Eyes of Texas will remain a staple of University of Texas athletic events will be played at the end of every football game. Not only this, the board confirms, the administration confirms, the coaches and players confirm all players will be on the field and standing for the eyes from now on. Of course, it's up to the player if they want to sing or not, but as a sign of respect to the university, to those who came before them, to the fans, to the alums, the eyes of Texas prevail. So I want to thank the Board of Regents for the University of Texas at Austin. Thank you so much for inspiring the administration to do the right thing. It means a lot to me and to the hundreds of thousands, if not millions, of Longhorn alums and fans out there. Also want to thank the administration for UT Austin for stepping up and doing the right thing. I know you're making the effort to make the 40 acres a more welcoming place. And I do respect that. But it's important also to make sure UT is welcoming to the fans and the alumni as well. And by preserving the eyes of Texas, that's what you've done. So thank you. Thank you to the athletic director, Chris Del Conte. Thank you to the coaching staff of Tom Herman as well. But most of all, the biggest thanks of all to the players. Thank you so much for doing this. I know you have been pulled in 10,000 different directions since this summer. I know you have countless people in your ear telling you what to do and how to do it and who to represent and how to represent. A tremendous amount of pressure, I know, has been put on your shoulders. And I know a lot of you have felt like you are being pulled maybe 10,000, maybe a million different directions. So I want to take this time to say thank you Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you for standing up for the eyes, but also thank you for representing the university. I can't even imagine the amount of work that goes into doing what you do. So just want to take this time to say I appreciate you and thank you. And in the future, if there are issues that are coming up or changes that you feel that need to be made on campus, come to the fans, man. Come to us first. Trust us to listen to what you have to say. The relationship between the fans and the players has been wonderful for the past 50 years. So I want you to be able to trust that relationship and come to us with problems. We'll listen doesn't mean we're always going to agree with everything you say or observe. But you'll be surprised by the amount of people who will agree with you. So do me a favor, and next time, come to us as friends, man, and, and not as like a hostage situation. And I know you got people in your ear telling you that's the way it needs to be, but I'm saying this as an alum and as a fan and as a supporter. Trust us enough to let us know what's going on. And you'll be surprised by the amount of things we can accomplish together. Having said that, I wish you the best this Halloween in Stillwater. Those guys, I think, are a little bit high on their horse. They think that they own the University of Texas. So you've got my full support. You've got the full support of Longhorn Nation. Go up there, kick their asses, and come back home and you're going to get the hero's welcome that you deserve. This is Kevin Newsom coming to you from Houston, Texas, saying God bless each and every one of you. Hook them horns. I'll talk to you later. Bye.